Hello and welcome to this video on Google BigQuery. In this video, I'm going to show you how to reformat dates in BigQuery. Okay, so let's say you have a date column within a table, and the format for that date column is the year, month, day format. But you want to change that format. You want to have the data within that column with a different format, let's say the day, month, year format. Here's how you can do it. You can basically create a copy of that column by using a very simple select statement. And the function you'll need to use in order to transform and reformat the date is the format date function within BigQuery. So here's how the select statement goes. You have to write select, format, underline date, open parentheses, single quotation, percentage sign, let's say we want to reformat to the day, month, year format from whatever format the date column is currently at. Let's say the current date format is year, month, day, and we want to change it to day, month, year. We have to put single quotation, percentage sign, D hyphen, percentage sign, M hyphen, percentage sign, Y, and another single quotation followed by comma, and then the name of that particular column, which in this case is, for example, contract start date, and then close parentheses. Since we are doing this transformation within a select statement, what we're basically doing is we're creating another column. We're not changing the format in this column. We are creating another column using this select statement, which has the new date format. And I've named that new column the contract underline start underline date underline transformed column. In other words, the existing column format remains intact and the new column we created using the select statement is the column which manifests this new format. And this is the column we could use if we want to have this particular format. Now note that uh, in this particular select statement, we have hyphen between the day, the month, and the year. You could also put, let's say, a forward slash, if that's the format that you want your date to be in. Day, forward slash, month, forward slash, year, and it's going to work exactly the same way. So this gives us a lot of flexibility on how we can format the date using this helper column. And the next line of code is the from, so you're selecting the format date, as I just described, from your project name, data set name, and the table within which this particular column belongs to. And that's how it's done. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed already, make sure to subscribe and also turn on notifications so you won't miss out on my next videos.